Welcome back guys to another episode of The Devil and Me. The Dark Pictures Anthology, the season finale. The last episode of the series for now until next year, basically. So here we go, last time we left off we were in the 40s, 50s in this weird hotel because uh, we got married. And um, surprisingly enough, we got, it was like a torture chamber type thing. Uh, the, our wife got uh, her throat slit and she unalived. And us, we got gas chambered to death, basically. And uh, now we're actually continuing with the story. I think last time we saw, we were in the, uh, in the trial, court trial thing. I don't know. So let's continue with the story. Let's go. Of the Dark Pictures Anthology. I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You don't seem to understand. I was born with the devil in me. Roll the credits, folks. I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. Bury me deep, your honor. Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else. And cover the ground with more cement, cause trust me. Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, AKA Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows his neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Records indicate he hung, slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes, until finally the monster was dead. America's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders, but his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind, following his path from city to city. The number grew significantly, nearly 200 Damn. lives. America's first serial killer, and possibly the worst. He was buried as requested, under concrete. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? What is this? Sir, what do you think? To be honest, Charlie, this is a pilot. Hold that thought. Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking, Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. I'm certainly grateful to you, Mr. Mm. Dumet. This all sounds amazing, but I, uh, I just, I'm waiting to hear what the catch is. No offense. None taken. I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much, but my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon, 4 p.m., be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I've told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Without them, this conversation is dead in the water. We, uh... I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? Yes. Of course. We're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Let's do it. Bearing updated. What is, what is it? Okay. Charlie received a call from, uh, Grantham Dumay and accepted the invitation to his, uh, H.H. H. Holmes inspired murdered castle. Okay, so we're here. Well, let's go. This is not good. Mr. Dumet send you. We... Right. Let's load up, guys. All right, got That's it. That's great. I'm good. We're all gonna die tonight. Just saying. It's all gonna right. be like at least like one survivor at the end Are of this you? game. <laughs> like always. I mean, I mean last game we, uh, we got like three out of the five right. or the six. I don't know how many. This is gonna be grand, people. Adventure. Excitement. Anyone? 
Road trip. Huzzah. Woohoo. Freaking limo, dude. You guys are freaking royalty. So do we know where we're going exactly? You don't like surprises? You know what this just reminds me of? Don't say it. Topeka? Exactly. Me, no money in my pocket, a dead phone, and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault, because you fly by the seat of your ass. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's rich, he's a recluse, he's obsessed with H.H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. We're going to a property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Some of the rooms are full recreations from the murder castle. Dumet has blueprints, documents, artifacts. When I said this would save the show, I was not exaggerating. And you substantiated all of this? Just trust me. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones for safekeeping. While this may sound strange that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices that Is may share information that can we know affect my this? business or lifestyle. There are rules. All footage you wish to use must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. I must insist. His place, his rules. Oh, God. Look, what he's offering us is worth it. Could be making us pay, but he isn't. If this is all he asks, then we do. Fine. For the show. I'm telling you, this is going to be great. No, it's you not. You said that into Pika. <clears throat> Trust me, it's not going to be great. It's going to be like a saw game type thing. Trust me. If this dude is so rich, shouldn't he have service or something? This guy going to help? <clears throat> no, really. I got it. Thanks, bro. Don't sweat it, jackass. And goodbye. At least forever, I guess. Okay. So now what? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and the scope of this. Not with all the mist and fog. There. From on high, we'll get a better look. That's certainly um, up there. The, the visuals will be great, and we can frame up over the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. <laughs> Mark, this is crazy. Oh, we'll be fine. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice knowing you. We're all gonna die, like I said before. Oh, we're playing as the uh, professor, or whatever this guy is. is. What do we do? Okay, so we're going in circles, basically. Uh, we climb up here. Yep. <coughs> Alright, let's go. Any collectibles, so we can know our future, basically. Hey, guys, hurry up. We're on it. Oh, cool. Now we can jog. Jesus, that is loud. Man, it's meant to be heard from miles away. Well, yeah, I know that in theory, but... Oh, so much for plan A. We must be able to work our way around. Come on. Well, this is kind of cool. Hey, we have, like, new mechanics right? in the game. Like, jump around. Listen, Mark, I just wanted to say, um... Thanks for backing me up, man. What? About getting this footage? No, for the whole trip. You know, some of the crew can be challenging. To work with. Oh, I get. Give me a second. Let me Don't go back for a minute, never real quick. Come if you haven't been on board. I figured that 
the episode was such a mess, we needed all the help we could get. Right. Yeah. Ah, oh, crap. I don't think I we can did. climb up again. Fuck. Okay. So, we're stuck going through this. Ah, damn it. We could have gone the other direction to see if we had something. We could have, like, picked up or something. Same shit. Okay. This game feels a little bit different. Huh. It's over here. Okay, nothing. Okay, I won't lie. I was hoping being here all remote and away from the world that maybe I'd have some downtime, some space to decompress. Downtime? Why would you want to do that? You know, relax a bit. I've never seen the attraction. Oh, okay. So it was earlier than that. It was like 1907s. God, 1900s. It was in the 1940s or 50s. Okay, jump. Platforming. Definitely this game feels so different than the uh, other view. I'd like to take a couple weeks off. Go see my family. I need you in post. Uh, no. I really appreciate that. Okay, so this game just became life. from like a horror, you know, know movie driven on. game or whatever to like a oh, platforming right, adventure yeah, game. Sure. What is this? Take a couple of weeks. We head together. I appreciate it. I'll be fine in post on that. You should do the same. Take some time out. You got any family you can go and bother? Oh, well. No, Mrs. Lonnet, you got hiding in some closet somewhere? Married to the job. Married to the job. <laughs> what? How's that marriage working out? Oh my god, okay. Well, from what I hear about real marriages, pretty damn good. <laughs> Married to the job. We did it. We did it. Let's do this tight crawl. I mean, walk. Please, no jump scares. Please, no jump scares. Please, no jump scares. What the fuck? I fucking said no jump scares. Christ, what the hell is that? A mannequin. You know. Oh, just, dude. Sorry. Maybe it's part of some old museum <laughs> display or something. Right. I felt that. That's probably it. I called it. I freaking called it was going to be like a jump scare. I thought it was a crow, but damn. <laughs> oh, that got me. That got me. Holy shit, dude. Okay, let's continue on. Okay. You coming? Yeah. Just Should be something around here that I can collect. How is that gonna fit into the show? It just caught my eye. Coming. There's a few places Always we can go to. I'm just gonna exactly turn see it this off. one. There's a lot of crossover between the creative stuff and the commercial stuff. Ah, oh, it's mm. locked. Great. You sure about that? Because crossover with Kate hasn't exactly. We agreed to let that drop for the weekend. Just making sure your head's in the game. Nice. Light? No light? This thing hasn't been manned in ages. Why's the horn still going? Because they didn't decommission the fog. It's all automatic now. There's no light here. I can't use my... Okay, never mind. Read, please. Okay, four. Okay, so it's gonna be April 10th, 2000. 
Keep it up, team. This should be the final week. Last night, for Falkhorn test was successful. It looks like the automation is all up and running. We all do one final trial today. Then we can pack up and away in the kit, whatever. The couple, the couple of you have reported that homeless guy hanging around again. We're going to be bumping up security, securing the compound. Blah blah blah. Okay. Security method. Crap. Oh, I don't need to read that. Okay, let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> what do we got here? Hold up. Before anything we do, we go there and let's... Find this. Let's go this place. Let's go over here to see if we can unlock it. Lock tight. Come on. There must be another way. You sure? No. I'm optimistic. Okay, so the way forward is over here then. Cool. Oh, okay. Yep. Interact. Yes. Fish factory to close. Exciting times. Fish factory. Okay. This feels weird, like it's too open. <laughs> it's too open for me, for like a dark picture anthology game. I like, no, thank you. Oh god, okay, square! Found one. What's that? Just some old coin. Find a penny. Pick it up. We found a collectible. Well, look. Sorry, I give you a hard time. Now and again. Well, this is not a premonition thing I'm that really we can see towards the, the future, future, but that's not found some, true. We found I'm something. I'm driving this car. What car? The Lonnie Entertainment car. But you're the one who keeps the engine going. That's not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. I get it. Okay. Come on. It's locked. Oh, I see. No, okay. So, yeah, push the object. Push it. No, climb. Push, 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 push. Just a 
little breaking and entering. How are you not in jail? Christ, what the hell is that? Okay. Nice to meet you too. The hell was that? Shit, okay. Oh, there you go. Just need some fresh sheets, some nice drapes, and six gallons of sanitizer. Okay, no, we can't go inside the doors yet. Go upstairs. This is creepy, dude. What the fuck? Charlie, I'm getting an uneasy feeling about this. Somebody has a taxidermy hobby. Relax. <laughs> Some hobby. What in God's name is this? It's a bird. What the fuck, dude? It moved. What? No. It moved. Oh, dude, 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 this game is way different than the other one. This one is actually jump scary. The other one was more like fucking defeating vampires in underground, like in an underground temple. This was like literally back to like that scare factor that uh, Little Hope had. I'm gonna get scared a lot. I'm sorry. For <laughs> it's gonna be okay. Oh, it's gonna be okay. It's gonna be fun. Look at this. It's perfect. Come on, get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. There's an island. Look, there's all right. Come on, we better get back. Good. It's a little fairy thing. That him? I don't know. We just had the one call. Uh, how did he know what our show was about in the first place? Uh, actually, I didn't ask. That's weird. Let's just play nice, okay? Hello, Mr. Lonnet. That's me. I'm Grantham Dumet. Everyone climb aboard and we'll head out. This is Mark. Mark. Erin, Jamie. Ladies. And this is Kate. Pleased to meet you, Mr. Dumet. I'm looking forward to seeing all it is you have to offer. We truly appreciate this. Lovely to meet you all. What say we get underway? Again, I really can't thank you enough for this. Very opinion. updated. Okay, so Charlie I received a call blah. Okay. The crew met uh Grantham Dume. Okay. Cool. You met the dude. Of course. Was it your great uncle you said that um, Let's get to where we're going. I'll explain everything later. Sure. Of course. What's going on here? You think seem excited to go to like a murder castle? It's gonna fuck. It's gonna be insane.
Who the hell are you? I saw that. Let's get up to the hotel. Uh, please, let's stay close. Stick together. Is it dangerous here? No. Very dangerous. Not. Trust me, you sure? you're all gonna die tonight. Because you don't seem sure. It's perfectly safe. But we are a long ways from help if somebody gets hurt. So please, take care. Looks like things have buttoned up tight around here. God. This way. Don't worry about your bags. I'll make sure they're brought. Be playful. Ambitious, anxious, bold. Erudite? Kate. How you doing, Kate? Slow, deep breaths, Charles. Try not to cough up a diseased lung. <laughs> I'll be fine. Oh, God. Just pretend there's a carton of smokes at the top of the hill. You're right. He takes his security very seriously. Keep out. I wonder Don't what he's afraid will get in. Maybe you should be asking what he's trying not to let out. Jamie. Just saying. You yeah, that girl reminds me a lot of the first one. Like she prince. was in uh, Man of the God. Right We've known Her. that for about two hours. She looks hours. the same, dude. Just That's like repeating characters throughout the, the series. I tell you that Mark, for sure, because I've, I've noticed that. Intro from here. At least there's one or two characters shots from each house. one that have been in like previous Kate, episodes. Talking to camera, then I'll direct you from there, okay? No photos. No recording of me at all. Is that clear? I'm... A very private person. Don't worry, Mr. Dumet. Discretion is Lonnie Entertainment's motto. You want the usual intro stuff, Charlie? Please. The light is good. I'm ready to go, Aaron. It sounds clear. Okay, let's go for a tag then. Is Kate's face ready? Bitch, I'm always camera ready. Stop trying to make me like you. Rolling. Speed. And action. I've just arrived on the private island which claims to have genuine artifacts from H.H. H. Holmes' reign of terror. I'm heading to the house right now. Perfect, Kate. Now turn to face the house and start to walk. Okay, that's enough. And cut. We really do need to get going. Anything you say, Mr. Dumas? This way. You'll steal some more shots, right? Obviously. Hmm. What the hell is that guy? Mr. Dumet is being really restrictive. I noticed. I want you to get a look around without him knowing. The man is entitled to his privacy. He's caging. I want to know what he's trying to hide. What do you want to do? What you did that time with those cops in Glendale. Seriously? Ah! Oh, ow! Oh, oh my! Damn it! What happened? What the hell? Okay. Oh. Did your baby ego again? We should get her up to the hotel. Oh my! I can barely move it. Jamie, stay with her. Why me? Because you know first aid. Hmm. Remember how you patched her up in Glendale? What the hell happened oh, to her? Right. She faking okay. it? We'll find some ice and a bandage and come back. You have that at the hotel? Yes, sure. Then let's go. What is going on? Come on. I'll clue you in later. Been taking acting classes again? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What's Charlie want? A better lay of the land. And we're the scouts because... I'm charming. And you can hotwire your way past security. Come on. Great. Great. Yeah, totally was faking it. <laughs> okay, folks, I'm just gonna cut it out here. Thank you for watching. Stay frosty mental. Watch for the next video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye, folks.